Hi guys, today I'm going to be talking about one of my biggest pet peeves when I travel, and that is dealing with charging cables. I hate cables. I still dream of living in a world where everything will be wireless. Unfortunately, we're not quite there yet, but thankfully recent years have provided a lot of solutions that make it a little bit more efficient to organize and reduce the amount of cables that you actually have to carry with you while you travel. Uh, so I've gathered around some of my favorite gadgets and uh, organizational methods and I'm going to take you through them one by one to show how you may be able to relieve some of the headaches that come with cables while you're traveling. So let's take a closer look. So my first favorite solution to the issue of traveling with multiple cables and reducing cable clutter is these multi-pronged adapters that have multiple different types of cables combined into one. Uh, so this one in particular has been my favorite as of late from Chiffon. Um, and so it has the USB side that you would plug into your computer or a power brick of some sort. And then it has um, connectors for USB-C, two micro USBs, it has a lightning port, and a, um, a mini USB as well. So it covers all the devices that I would typically carry. And that's awesome that it has an extra micro USB um, port because that's the one I tend to use the most. Uh, but this is a really, really, really convenient uh, cable to have. It keeps everything organized. As you can see, the wires are a little short. Um, and it has just enough for all the devices that I would typically carry. The quality seems really good. I know with a lot of these kind of uh, multi cables, sometimes the lightning port or the USB-C can kind of be a little bit tricky or if it's not a well-known brand it can kind of uh, die on you pretty quickly but so far I've had this for uh, about four or five months already and I haven't had any issues as of yet um, and I've been on a few trips with it and I can say that it has been a godsend so I it you know it's only about ten dollars I think for the cable and it really really provides a lot of convenience you can fit this in a pocket or um, in a bag really easily so I highly recommend giving this a shot to help reduce some of your cable clutter so if you're not able to find a multi-port adapter or if you're, um, if you're looking for an alternative solution to, uh, to carrying multiple cables, um, you know, the, the previous cable that I showed, you know, it had a lot of different ports on it, but the problem is it's a little bit short, uh, so you wouldn't really be able to connect this to the wall and then have your phone on the bed or anything like that. So if that is a problem for you, I would definitely recommend checking out retractable cables. So I really love these because it really it reduces uh, wire clutter quite a bit. As you can see, you know this is really easy to throw into the bag. Uh, it's not going to get tangled anywhere, and then you can kind of extend it out uh, to whatever length you need. So this I'm not entirely sure. I think this would be about a three to four foot cable, and you can plug it in and use it. And then when you're done, you just retract it back into its case, and it packs up really nicely. So this is what um, I use for my when I travel for my lightning cable. Uh, I really like that it's really compact. Uh, it's tangle free based on how flat the cable is. Uh, this is from Retech, Retrek. And I got this one at Best Buy. I believe you can find them online as well. So I'll be posting links to where you can get all these cables. Um, and this is a retractable HDMI cable, which I thought was awesome. Uh, for, so when we travel and I take my iPad, I have uh, the HDMI adapter so I can plug this into the TV at the hotel. We just want to watch a movie or see any footage that we've shot during the day. And uh, again, this is just really nice because uh, HDMI cables can sometimes be really cumbersome and big and get tangled really easily. Uh, so it's really nice to kind of have this one that packs up really compactly. You can stretch it out. It's also a flat cable so it doesn't tangle. And the quality is really good as well. So this one is from Terragrand. And uh, I got this on Amazon for about 10 or 11 bucks. So um, as you can see, none of these cables will break in the bank. They're all really good quality. And most importantly, they help keep everything nice and neat while you're traveling. So in addition to having retractable cables and multi-port cables, one thing that I found is really useful is to actually have these short cables. I absolutely love these, uh, particular for, particularly for when I'm moving around during the day. Uh, these work really well with external batteries. Uh, it's really annoying when you have a huge cable plugged into your external battery and you're trying to keep all that organized in your pocket or in your backpack or something. So as you can see, this cable is so short, there's not really any way for it to tangle. Um, this is an Amazon Basics cable, um, really cheap. I think you know it was five bucks, or five or seven bucks, um, and it just it stays really, really uncluttered. 
it pairs well with the external batteries. So typically I'll just have two or three of these and put them each with an external battery so I can just kind of grab and go for the day. And, uh, you know, it just pairs really nicely with, you know, instead of having a longer cable in your bag all day, this is typically enough to get you through your everyday so that when you get back to your hotel or your house, uh, you can use one of your longer ones but not have to deal with it through the entire day. So when you're traveling and uh, trying to manage all your cables, another issue you'll have to deal with is the actual bricks uh, that you're going to be plugging into the wall. So, you know, it's really annoying to have to carry around three or four different power bricks for all the different devices you may be carrying for your GoPro, for your tablet, for your phone, for your external batteries. So one thing I've really started to use a lot is these multi-port bricks. Um, so this one from Alki. Aki is really is uh, is really affordable. It's kind of an improved version of Apple's uh, wall brick. So it has retractable prongs, which is really nice. So you can just put them in, make it a little bit smaller, and it also has two USB ports. Uh, so this is great to just carry around in your backpack during the day as you're moving around. So that if you need to plug in, and you and your wife or your girlfriend have both of your phones out, you can both plug in on the same one. And it takes up a little, you know, no space at all, and it really fits into a bag nicely, and that way you're reducing the amount of bricks you have to carry around with you. If you're looking for something with a little bit more capacity, I've really fallen in love with this Belkin kind of surge protector adapter. Uh, this is awesome because it has three uh, outlets that you can plug into, and then two USB ports as well, and it also has surge uh, protection capabilities. So this is really great for when I'm um, working uh, at a coffee shop or something, or in an airport. Uh, if there's not a lot of outlets, you can just plug this in and then um, add a few more ports. So easy way to make a friend or to just allow different people to work together and not have to hog a bunch of outlets together. And it's also just really compact. I love its form factor. I love that it doesn't add any wires. Uh, so you can just toss this in your bag really quickly. It doesn't take up a lot of space. Uh, it has a three-prong three plug. It's really cool that you can actually uh, adjust the direction. So it should be able to fit any sort of outlet that you find and not give uh, any issues based on the uh, prong configuration. And uh, so far the quality has been great, so I've been really, really happy with this. And definitely recommend you check it out. So um, I really like this Belkin adapter and uh, surge protector. It's been really great, but one thing I realized as I was traveling around a lot is that I don't really use these actual outlets that much anymore. The only reason I would use them is if I had um, to carry around a lot of uh, power bricks with me, such as the Aki one I had mentioned earlier. Um, but what I've been trying to do these days is to just use as little power bricks as possible. They take up a lot of space and really they're not that necessary. Uh, so if you're not actually using a lot of actual uh, bricks or prongs, what you can do is actually get one of these USB charging hubs, which I've fallen in love with recently. Uh, so this one is a five port charger and um, so far this has been so convenient for when I'm traveling abroad. So instead of having to worry about carrying all these different uh, bricks to plug into the walls, I can just worry about plugging the USB cables all into one spot and this makes it so convenient, especially when you're traveling abroad to um, different countries that have uh, different adapter types and you have to take the travel adapters, you can just plug this end into a travel adapter and then you instantly have, boom, five USB ports or six. They have a couple of different ones on the market. Uh, this is just the first cheap one that I found that uh, this was from PowerBot and so far it's been great. It charges all the devices um, you know, at a good speed. I've been able to charge two tablets and two phones and an external battery at once and I didn't have any issues. Uh, so, so far I've been really happy. Uh, the, only, the only downside to this that I see so far is just that it does add this kind of long cable that I have to take with me. But this is nice if you're at an airport or a coffee shop again and you don't want to actually have to sit close to the outlet. This can kind of come out a little bit and you can charge all your devices at once as opposed to the Belkin uh, adapter which plugs directly into the outlet and you, don't ha and you can't actually move away from it as far. So I really like that this gives you a little bit more flexibility. And uh, as I mentioned, just with how all modern devices are charging directly from USB, this is a little bit more convenient and helps reduce some of the clutter that, that I de deal with when traveling. So I definitely recommend adding one of these USB chargers to your um, traveling kit. And that's about it. Those are the best things that I've found so far to help reduce your clutter. And ever since I've reduced the amount of wires that I've been dealing with and reduced the amount of tangles, uh, the trips have gotten significantly more pleasant. Uh, so I definitely, uh, I definitely recommend checking each of these out. I'm going to add links below to uh, each of the items. 
And uh, if you like this video, please go ahead and uh, subscribe and give us a like. And uh, look forward to the next one. Thank you, guys. Thank mm -hmm. you.